Hey there, geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to talk about a little interesting problem I just bumped into. I went from a 34-inch curved monitor to a 34-inch ultra-widescreen flat monitor. And right away I noticed that it appeared to curve backwards. So there's not a lot of re reason for doing this video because there's not much to show you here. But what happened is when I look at it right about here in the middle, it appears to start curving in reverse and over here as well. So what you may be experiencing if you've done the same thing from a curve to a flat is headaches. Maybe going to check in with your opticians because you think something's wrong. Some people say it never goes away at all. Me, I had a little bit of headache with it and I'm thinking, not headache, but eye strain. And I'm thinking that might be more because of I'm turning my head and my eyes more and the fonts are a little bit different and smaller even though I brought them back up. And of course, like a lot of other people, I thought it was a defective monitor. But all you got to do is walk around to the side and look up and down. And sure enough, it's not curved backwards. It's perfectly flat. So if you're seeing this, it's not you. It's probably your brain. It's your brain or your eyes. So I'm hoping maybe we have a doctor or a neuroscience or something like that who can say, hey, this is what causes it. Cause I, I, I probably won't even understand it, but it'd be cool to understand it. So... You've got a couple of choices here. If you're about to buy a new monitor and you're thinking about going curved to flat, if you're widescreen or a big monitor, I'd prefer a curved monitor. I think I see more. I think I don't turn my head as much. I think the curve delivers. And I think personally, the larger the monitor, the better a curved monitor works in my opinion. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take the monitor back. I've got the 34 inch widescreen. I'm going to look online, and try and find a 34 inch curved ultra wide screen and it's up to you of course now here's the next thing how long does it last they say two to three weeks but i don't know how much time a day that two to three weeks lasts i assume that those who are saying two to three weeks are people who are working on their computers and probably sitting on them six to eight hours a day hence the variation between two and three weeks i don't know i used it two hours yesterday i am about five and a half in it today so I'm still seeing the curve I can look at my desktop and it's still like oh it's so curved really literally just a nice smooth slow curve from right down the center over to here backwards it's really bizarre it's freaking me out but uh, here we get a chance to try it <laughs> if you've got a curved monitor and you've got a flat one laying around try it sometimes it's really really weird that's all so I thought it'd be nice just inform people about it. And hopefully, again, this article is linked to in the video description. I hope to update it towards the bottom if I can hear from somebody who can explain to me what my brain or my eyes are doing to me. That'd be kind of cool. I probably won't understand it, but it'd be cool to tell other people. So fingers crossed if somebody knows something I don't. And there you have it. So next time you want to change monitors, if you've got a curve, you might want to stick with curve just to make life a little bit easier not go through this for two to three weeks especially if you're working on your computer or even if you're gaming a lot if you use it a lot do you really want to sit there for two to three weeks getting freaked out yeah it's not worth it for me so back to the store curved it is so there you have it that's uh the best i can explain to you what happens and why you're seeing your computer monitor look like it's bending backwards that's not you it's probably your brain all right, bottom right-hand corner, click subscribe if we helped you out. I thought that was pretty cool. And I got to get off of this thing and get my monitor back on for now. There you have it. Thanks for watching. See you.